Hey, this is Larry Janeski with the All Things Basement Tea video series. Basement waterproofing, basement finishing, foundation structural repair, and nasty crawl spaces too. Today we're going to be talking about how to waterproof a basement with stone walls. Let's take a look. When talking about how to waterproof any foundation, a lot of people think automatically, well let's dig it up outside and waterproof the walls and put a drainage system on the outside. But the biggest problem is digging. Uh, I mean, how? look at this beautiful landscaping and this porch. In order to do this right, this landscaping would have to go. A giant hole is dug. All that dirt is on the rest of the lawn. This porch really would have to come off of the house because the foundation is on the other side of it. Uh, you have air conditioning units, driveways, sidewalks, decks that all would have to come off of the house in order to do that uh, properly. And that becomes uh, just a huge uh, a problem. Besides that, if you have a, a flat building lot and you put a drainage system in, where's the drain going to go? So. Uh, let me show you how we can do that on the inside of the house. You know, stone foundation walls can leak at any elevation off of the basement floor because they're porous and they have air spaces in between the individual stones and in the, the mortar joints there's a lot of space so water can get through the wall and then flow through these spaces in the wall and it can leak through at floor level, uh, just below floor level and come up, come up at the floor wall joint. Water can leak two feet off the floor, six feet off the floor. And so what we need to do are two things. We need to install a drainage system in the perimeter of the basement floor to catch that water and drain it away to a sump pump. And we need to install a vapor barrier, and there's a number of different options that could be installed on a stone wall so that this water, when it leaks through the wall, it runs down into the drainage system without being seen by the homeowner. If there were things leaning against the wall, they don't get wet. Nobody knows it's leaking at all. It's drained silently and easily uh, away without causing any damage or any even increase in humidity in the basement. And this is a water guard drainage system uh, that gets installed at the perimeter of the floor to take care of our drainage uh, requirement. And let's take a look at the vapor barrier we're installing on these stone walls. So here we see the stone walls that uh, leak. Uh, you can see the efflorescence, which is uh, minerals from the uh, dirt that is brought through the wall and then the water evaporates and it leaves the minerals behind. But uh, this is our leaky stone wall and we've got this um, vapor barrier called clean space that's installed on the walls uh, in this area where the homeowner is going to finish the basement and it's tucked into the water guard system here, you see? So this is tucked behind. So if any water leaks behind this vapor barrier, it goes into this drainage system and this floor is going to be reconcreted um, so that no water can get from these walls onto this floor and this wall can't be wet either. We've run a four inch PVC pipe from the drainage system into this a little odd in this basement. Uh, we have this little room here with a dirt floor, but we've run this uh, four inch PVC pipe to uh, the sump pump liner so that the water from the entire perimeter of the basement can run to the sump location and get pumped out. And here we have actually a, what's called a triple safe sump pump system. This will have three pumps installed in it, AC operated one third horsepower primary pump, a AC half horsepower AC backup pump, and then uh, a battery operated DC pump in case the power goes out. This will pump the water out and that's the final path for the water that leaks into this basement to get back out without ever bothering the homeowner. I hope this video on how to waterproof a basement with stone walls was helpful. If you like this video, like or share it with your friends. See you next time on All Things Basement Tea.